Hi guys, Mark is here and welcome to Chinese Entertainment Update, June 25th, 2023. I release episodes every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday between 7 and 10 p.m. Pacific Time. This is episode 703, and the rundown with timestamps is in the description box below. Now, because I use Chinese names quite a bit on my show, if you want the English spelling of them, you can turn on subtitles. I create them myself. In today's episode, Destined and Hidden Love are the two hottest web dramas at the moment. And I'll touch on the Magnolia Awards and what three-time nominee Zhao Liying said on the night. So it'll be a shorter episode today. I took advantage of the good weather and took a trip with the family over the weekend. And I was actually thinking of scrapping today's episode altogether. But I thought, hey, I gotta at least bring you guys the top 10 dramas of the week, which I'll get into in a bit. And as I prepared for the episode, I couldn't help myself and just added a couple of quick stories as well. Hope you enjoy them. But as always, we begin with what's recently premiered, one drama for today and the past few days. The Outsider is a modern drama starring Kitty Zhang and Vengo Gao. It premiered earlier today. This premiere has been quite a while coming. The drama wrapped filming in March 2021, over two years ago. In fact, the drama didn't update on their official Weibo for over a year and a half, until a couple of days ago when they announced this premiere. Kitty Zhang last starred in 2022's The Kunlun Tomb, in which Vengo Gao actually had a guest appearance. His last starring role was in 2022's Operation Special Warfare. According to Baidu, in The Outsider, Kitty is an employee at a business conglomerate that falls into crisis after the death of its founder. Van Gogh is the founder's son who is battling for power against his aunt. The Outsider is slated for 36 episodes and is available on YouTube with English subs. That's it for what's recently premiered. Moving on, the two hottest web dramas at the moment are Destined and Hidden Love. Destin stars Pai Jingting and Song Yi. The costume drama premiered on June 18th and shortly after shared this poster to announce breaking 10,000 popularity points on Aichi Yi in just 41 hours. Hidden Love stars Zhao Lu Si and Chen Zhiyuan. The modern drama premiered on June 20th and shortly after shared this poster to announce breaking 10,000 popularity points on Yuku in just 30 hours. That is record time for modern idol dramas. The two dramas have literally been neck and neck on V-Linkage charts in the past few days. Some days their difference is just one or two points, other days it's decimal points. More on this later in the top 10 segment. Alright, that's it for drama updates. Moving on, celebrity updates, and today we begin with a mention of the recently held Magnolia Awards. The Magnolia Awards are handed out at the Shanghai Television Festival. Along with the Flying Apsaras and the Golden Eagle, the three are considered the most prestigious awards in Chinese television. This year's awards, the 28th edition, was held on June 23rd and was dominated by two dramas, A Lifelong Journey and Bright Future. Here is a list of the winners on the night. Both A Lifelong Journey and Bright Future were winners of Best TV Series China. A Lifelong Journey won for Best Director and Best Adapted Screenplay, whereas Bright Future won for Best Original Screenplay. Lei Jiaying took home Best Actor for his performance in A Lifelong Journey, and Wu Ye took home Best Actress for her performance in Bright Future. Ding Yongdai took home Best Supporting Actor for his performance in A Lifelong Journey, and Liu Dan took home Best Supporting Actress for her performance in Reset. The winners aside, Wan Zhao Liying also became a topic of discussion on the night. She was nominated for Best Actress for a performance in Wild Bloom but didn't win. This made it three nominations without a win. The topic, Zhao Liying, three times running along with, trended and was viewed over 400 million times in one day. The 35-year-old actress was obviously one of those viewers as she responded with a brief but positive message, continue running. She also shared a photo of herself, dressed in a gown, squatting in a corner, looking through the lens of a camera. On that note, it's Sunday today, so time for the Top 10 Chinese Dramas of the Week, edition 178, June 25th, 2023. The data is provided by V-Linkage, a marketing consultant company based in Shanghai. They provide top drama charts every day. 
In this segment, the drama standings are based on their 7-day total points beginning last Sunday and ending yesterday. We begin with the top 10 web dramas. The list is based on view counts on Yuku, Aichi and Tencent, social media discussions and Baidu searches. Number 10, Gone with the Rain, the costume drama stars Changnan and Yuvin Wang. Number 9, My Marvelous Fable, the modern drama stars Wang Feifei and Miles Wei. Number 8, Snow Eagle Lord, the costume drama stars Shui Kai and Guli Naja. Number 7, The Long Season, the modern drama stars Fan Wei and Ching Hao. Number 6, Here We Meet Again, the modern drama stars Janice Wu and Vin Zhang. Number 5, Hidden Love, the modern drama stars Zhao Lu Si and Chen Zhiyuan. Number 4, Beauty of Resilience, the costume drama stars Xu Jingyi and Fiction Guo. Number 3, When I Fly Towards You, the modern drama stars Zhou Yiran and Zhang Miaoyi. Number 2, Stand or Fall, the modern drama stars Qinglan and Wang Yang. And number 1, Destined, the costume drama stars Bai Jingting and Song Yi. Destined is champion for the first time since its premiere. It garnered 586 points. So just harking back to an earlier point, Hidden Love premiered on June 20th, so it's two days behind on points, hence it's number 5 position, which is actually quite good considering. But as I mentioned earlier, it's been neck and neck with Destined in the past few days, so next week we should see them in the top 2. What order remains to be seen. Alright, next up, here are the top 10 Chinese TV dramas of the week. The list is based on TV ratings and social media discussions in China. Number 10, Sisterhood, the Republican era drama stars Xiao Yan and Tai Xiangyu. Number 9, A Generation of Craftsmen, the Republican era drama stars Hou Yong and Lan Xi. Number 8, The Ordinary Road, the modern drama stars Guo Qiling and Jin Jin. Number 7, Gen Z, the modern drama stars Wu Kang and Zhao Lu Si. Number 6, The Knockout, the modern drama stars Zhang Yi and Zhang Songwen. Number 5, In Later Years, the modern drama stars Hao Lei and Angel Wang. Number 4, A Date with the Future, the modern drama stars William Chan and Zhang Ronan. Number 3, The White Castle, the modern drama stars Peng Guan Ying and Tu Sung Yan. Number 2, Prosecution Elite, the modern drama stars Dil Raba and Tong Da Wei. And number 1, The Youth Memories, the retro drama stars Xiao Zhan and Li Qing. The Youth Memories ends the week with 555 points, making it champion for a third week running. And there it is guys, hope this gives you an idea of what dramas are hot in Chinese drama land at the moment. Tune in again next week to see how your favorite dramas perform. And that brings us to the end of this episode. Have a great weekend ahead and I'll see you guys Tuesday. As always, stay safe and I wish you clear blue skies, good health and happiness. Until next time, cheers.